Mel. Thanks for another wonderful evening. I had a great time, too. Uh, I hope this isn't too forward, but how about tomorrow night? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I already have plans with my daughter. We're trying to spend a lot of quality time together these days. Well, so bring her. I'll bring David. We'll make it a foursome. We'll go someplace nice. That sounds great. Good. Are you sure there's nothing weird about you? Something that you're hiding? <laughs> no, why? I'm used to men with major liabilities. You just seem too good to be true. Well, give it time. Under the surface, I'm an egomaniacal monster, but by the time you find out the truth, it'll be too late. You'll be in my clutches. How frightening. <laughs> Mom, is that you? Yeah, hi, Kelly. I'll be up in a minute. I'll pick you up at 7. Good night. Good night. How'd it go? Two for two. Mom, I thought they told you you should stay single for a while, to adjust to being sober. Kelly, please. You can't be both my therapist and my daughter. Which is it going to be? I know, but he just does not seem like your type. Well, you can get to know him better tomorrow. Tomorrow? I thought you and I were having dinner together tomorrow. I know, but I thought we'd make it a happy foursome. You, me, Mel, and David. Doesn't that sound fun? No, that sounds totally excruciating. Well, at least we're being honest. Good night, sweetie. I'm beat. What if I can't make it? Kelly, you're going to make it. Hey, Kel. How about a few words of summer wisdom for posterity? Get lost. Hey, Steve. Uh, how about you? Well, what can I say? It's great to be young. I wish they all could be California girls. Do you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> uh, see you tonight, Kel. Mm, I'm counting the minutes. Me too. So to what do we owe your sunny disposition? How can you stand him? David Silver? Humor him. What's a big deal? It's true about your mom and his dad, huh? We're all going to dinner tonight, just the four of us. Won't that be cozy? They want you to get along already. That's quick. What do you mean? Kelly, single parents never want the two sides to get together unless it's serious. You really think so? I mean, they haven't slept together or anything. <laughs> Kelly, get with it. Sex is out of the loop these days. It all depends on how they get along personally and financially. My mom was saying how much they had in common. And he is rich. Well, then this dinner can only mean one thing. A romantic declaration of love in front of the kids. I think I'm going to be sick. See, what can I do to stop this thing? Well, there is one thing that'll totally scare off a prospective step-parent. But it takes guts. Though well, I'm sure you've got that. What is it? You've got to let David Silver's father know right from the start that life with you won't be worth living. You've got to be the uh, stepchild from hell. <laughs> <laughs>